it's Paige Wagon Art, and so what is my favorite watercolor palette? Um, this, this right here. So let's dig in and find out why. So everyone has their, you know, quote quote favorite palette. This is mine. Um, so the base of this palette is this, the Magello. 17 pure pigment watercolor. So I started off with this and I immediately loved it. This isn't a great set. Um, it's just um, actually I liked it so much that I end up getting because I wanted more colors the Magello 34 set and that one's right here. Um, this this is a great set. I did an unboxing on my channel of this. Um, there's some colors I wanted from that set that I felt like it needed. And yes, I and I did. I have this set as well. And but the difference with this set is I added in my favorite colors. So I have 17 from this, and I added in to customize the colors that I, I like can't live without. Um, so let's look at this larger. This is a swatch card of the 17 that's in here with my swatch card that is laminated in here. Um, so what I added in to uh, customize it as my, my quote go-to set is here are the colors I added in. I just felt like it just kind of balanced out was this other uh, permanent yellow light from this Magello 34, which um, is a really nice yellow, this yellow green, um, which is from this Magello set. And I like that because it's kind of like this fresh green that I liked, um, which is nice for, you know, doing botanicals and you want to get like a light green that's like fresh. Um, this Avanda um, green rounds out these greens that I like. And this green is like, can get super, super dark yet it has, you can get it very light. It has like a nice range and you can mix it with yellows and greens and it's very nice. Now, another, the other two I put um, from the Magello 34 that I like is, oh my gosh, this um, Bright Opera. Oh my gosh, that's so, it's, it's a more than one pigment. I believe there's like two pigments, but gosh, look how nice, that's like a nice, bright pink that's a nice punch it's really great um and let's see what else did i put in there um now i also have in here and this is random um is that okay so the magello oh this is another um the magello the from the 34 set there the cerulean blue like I really like that cerulean blue, and but I actually added uh, another cerulean blue that, and this is from um, the, an art whale set. I did this is like super cheap that I got off Amazon, but there. This this set I did a review of this, but I was like super surprised. These colors are you can see they're vibrant and like it's a good cheap set. But oh my gosh, like look at that cerulean blue. It's like it's so nice for like a like a sky and it's just like like the, like a uh, it spreads really easily. I just really like that so much that I just added that to my basic set. Um let's see here. So another color that is my favorite Daniel Smith I add in that I could not live without is the Moon Glow. This is my um, go-to color for adding shadows. It is a granulating three pigment watercolor and it is so perfect for adding in those shadows. I don't use black. I usually actually don't even use earth tones. So if I want to have a shadow, Moon Glow is really great for me. I even like that granulating. It just, uh, it's great. Now, Another color that I just, I love from Winsor & Newton. 
even though the Magello comes with um, indigo, the indigo I would say is the one color that I was not as pleased as far as the the indigo that came with the set. It was more of a Payne's gray to me. Is this yummy Winsor Newton indigo? Oh my gosh, it's like so dark that it can look almost like a black but it has this blue and it's so rich but the shades going from this light to this medium saturation this is also a good shadowing color you can in fact I do sometimes this indigo with the moon glow that is like really nice um let's see here so I also like um, I popped out the Burnt Sienna with a, that came with the Magello. I do like that, but I have these three M. Graham paints that I really like. Okay, so, and I know I really like um, Mind of Watercolors, and I know he talks about a lot about the M. Graham, and I really like those paints. They're so nice. Um, but the, I really like, okay, this Burnt Sienna is a really lovely the Payne's Gray, really nice. Um, and this Terra Rosa, it is so, it's not like completely like transparent, but oh my gosh, this is such a rich color. Um, it flows really nice, which I really like about the M, M. Graham is that they flow very nicely. Um, so yeah, so this is the my set. And I put a little laminated card in here, and I like these little uh, metal palettes. And so, yep, there's my go-to set. Thanks for watching. Bye.